Hey there, producer. Welcome to Tuesday and happy Halloween, Bull. Hope you're having a good one. I think it's going to be a fun Halloween for you. I'm predicting sunny and social for the Tauruses. The moon is in Pisces, which is the way you relate to the world at large. All good, easy going. And your moon will be with the world today as the moon transits to your house of society, politics, and also your position in the world. So your heart wants to talk. Your heart wants to be out there. Go celebrate Halloween. You're going to enjoy it. In the background, though, Taurus, there is some karma going on. As we move around the solar system, five planets in Scorpio, your opposite sign, and Mercury moving retrograde tells me that it's time to rethink an area of your life, long-term relationships. That is the big topic. And as I've been studying Tauruses, I've started to get the big picture, so to speak, on how you go about changing your long-term relationship perspective. Now, for starters, we are about to end Chapter 1 Scorpio. Today, the sun is ruled by Saturn which says the universe is really encouraging everyone to make some decisions about what to do next. The first 10 days of Sun in Scorpio should have demonstrated to you, Taurus, what doesn't work, what you shouldn't do, what doesn't work for you, and how maybe you've been manifesting the same old pattern over and over and over again. Now as we enter Chapter 2, it's time to experiment with some new ideas. And I think for Tauruses, it comes down to really literally living in your opposite sign, which is Scorpio. One thing Scorpios are very good at is separating their peas from their carrots, so to speak. Scorpios rule duality, whereas Taurus is all about wholeness and oneness. That's why we're so stubborn. It's just very complicated to Tauruses. Well, a Scorpio has the ability to go, nope, I'm not gonna do this, and I'm gonna do that. And I think when it comes to Tauruses, it's time to separate your peas and carrots, separate the people that can be with you and that can't be with you, and quit looking at everyone as one good, holy goodness. You know what I'm saying? Think about that, Taurus, and come back tomorrow. We'll get on that topic again. In the meantime, Live, love, be. So God.